Let's go to Bonnie in Louisiana. Bonnie, let's uh you uh, i ask you to call in i want to hear what you've got to say please bonnie this is like amazing okay bonnie is she there yes okay go ahead bonnie you're on the air now this is from a very close friend of mine and he's a man who owns a business in this area and he told him that uh he had just got back from Las Vegas. Now, mind you, this business owner is not like one of us, you know. He's just a normal citizen. But he told him, he said he was in Las Vegas, and he was at one of the tables, and across the table from him was the coroner from Sandy Hook. That's the weird acting guy that's either a comedian or he is drunk or on drugs or something, he looked like. Staged actor. Anyway, he took a picture of him on his cell phone. And uh, so the guy, they got they got to talking when he saw him take a picture, and the man said, you know, this is pretty fishy about Sandy Hook. It's starting to look like a hoax. And the doctor said, it was a hoax. Wow. Now, I'm trying to get the picture where I can forward it to you, and I'm trying to get that man to call you in. He's got a business. He doesn't really want to. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I don't know that I'd want my name out there on this as well. <laughs> you know, too many yeah. people high around here in this administration. Uh, but I'm going to try and try my best maybe uh, next week to get the man to give you a call while you're on air. I would love that. It sounds like he was probably in uh, Las Vegas celebrating after the event took place. Possibly. He could have had a lot of money in his pocket. I, yeah, no kidding. I can't imagine why a coroner with this kind of investigation going on is in Las Vegas on a vacation, but then who knows? Uh-huh. Hey, thank you so much, Bonnie. Let me know. Do what you can on this. This is awesome. Thank yeah, you. This might be the very thing that could bring this entire administration to its knees. Oh, it could. It could. If we can flat out prove this, it will. I am convinced. Uh, we got a really bad connection with you there, so thank you so much, Bonnie. Bonnie's one of those people out there listening caring and doing something about it. She has done more good than you all will ever know uh, because she doesn't do it openly. She does it just on her own. Gorilla style. Gorilla style. That's Bonnie for you. Yeah. Thank you so much, Bonnie, from Louisiana. All right, let's go to, oh, this is a good day. Good day at the Power Hour. Sherry in Missouri. Hey, Sherry, are you the one that called in and told me about the guy that couldn't get his weapon out of the, uh, weapon out of the pump? 